Hi, this video is going to be all about beautiful prawns. We've got two types of prawns to show you. We've got a king prawn and a tiger prawn. The tiger prawn, you can tell the difference because of the darkest shell and also on the last segment of the prawn there's a black stripe there. On the king prawn it's a clear last section of the shell. We're going to show you how to fully peel a prawn. We take the prawn, hold it in your hand holding the head and the tail close to the join. Quickly spin the head and the tail in opposite directions and the head will just pull off. Lie the prawn on, the fing on your fingers with the underneath of the shell towards you and then we just roll the shell over the top of the prawn very carefully with our fingers all the way to the tip of the tail and then we can roll the prawn out of its shell and also give it a tug at the tail and there is a totally peeled prawn. The first way we're going to show you how to remove the vein, which is the little line that runs all the way around the back, is to take your knife and gently cut through the back of the prawn, open the prawn and the vein will be sat in there and you can pull the vein out. I'll just show you the vein on the table and there you've got your beautiful peeled prawn. We're going to show you a different way, which is to take the prawn, we'll this time work on the tiger prawn. We're going to remove the head the same way, a quick spin in opposite directions. We're going to lie the prawn on my hand, roll those little segments over the top of the prawn quite efficiently, all the way to the tip of the tail, and then we're going to pull the tail out from the shell, and there's another beautiful tail. This time, rather than split the back, I'm going to take my oyster knife, you can use any short implement for this, I'm going to, on the second join of the two segments, take my oyster knife, push it through the flesh a few millimetres into the prawn, very gently pull my knife backwards, and there's the vein, and we can pull the vein out from the middle of the prawn. As you can see again, worth removing the vein, and what this preparation does is it gives you a completely different texture, nice bite, explosion of flavour in your mouth. With this one, there isn't the explosion, but there is the deep, beautiful shellfish flavour. The next one that we're going to show you is actually a peeled tail on. We're going to take the prawn, twist the head and the body in different directions, roll the segments of the shell over the top of the prawn, but we're going to leave that last segment on. We're going to turn the prawn and remove the shell so that we have what we call a tail on presentation. I'm again going to split the back of the prawn with my knife, open the back of the prawn up, cut into the flesh of the prawn. We've done this so we open the prawn into what we call a butterfly shape, check for the vein, remove the vein with your fingers very carefully, and there we have a beautiful butterfly presentation, tail on. Now we're going to show you a final one, which is a nice way of cooking whole prawns. Rather than ripping the head off, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to start to remove the shell with the head on the prawn. I'm rolling the segments over the tail, leave the tip of the tail on, and remove that little bit of the shell that covers that beautiful bit of flesh in the middle. Carefully going round the head, leaving the head still joined to the prawn. At this stage I need to de-vein it, I just break the vein at the head end, turn the prawn round, one, two segments go underneath the vein, with the tip of the oyster knife, hold it with my thumb and pull the vein out of the prawn so it's totally de-veined. Now the prawn is ready to be skewered. What we're going to do is push the skewer through at the tail of the prawn, push it through into the head of the prawn, get the nice shape on the skewer and that's an amazing way of barbecuing your prawns. So once again, we've got the barbecue prawn, we've got the butterfly tail on prawn, we've got the peeled prawn with the split back and we've got the beautiful prawn with the closed back. Completely different ways of presenting prawns.